One of the wonderfully surreal things that has happened with EPN this year is we have partnered with Deadly Grounds and 8-Bit Beans to make a coffee, which is called the Espresso Playground, which I've actually tried here for the first time here at Fan Expo. This is Brad Maven, and Brad, your story is one that I really identify with because it's nuts. You said yeah, you love true. zombies and horror, right. and you love <laughs> coffee, and you, you made a business out of that. Yeah, essentially. Um, we started Deadly Grounds as a horror-themed coffee company. Yeah. Uh, myself, I've always been a horror fan, but I've also been a gamer as well my whole life. Yeah. So. Uh, once we were kind of done, not really done, but got Deadly Grounds to the point where we were really happy with, I thought, okay, I want to now do our gaming line of coffee. And you know, I was always that younger gamer that would always go for a coffee while I was gaming instead of drinking a Mountain Dew, for example. Yes. You know? So I wanted people that were like me to understand that uh, there's something out there for them. And I thought of you right away, you know, and that's why I reached out to you and said, hey, why don't we uh, collaborate on something here? Well, I was incredibly flattered when you did, and I thought this is one of the craziest pitches I've ever had. <laughs> I, I really didn't know if it was ever going to happen. Yeah. But then you, you made it happen. We made it happen. We made it happen. I mean, it was one of those things where you and I were back and forth for a while on yep. it, and we both got so busy with our other things going on in our lives. Yes, yep. And then we finally just said, let's just do this darn thing. Absolutely. And, and we did, yep. and it's been really great so far. It's been amazing, and the response has been super cool. The, uh, the, the They've been on, literally flying off the shelves here yeah. at Fan Expo. Absolutely. It, one of the coolest things is the logo that your friend Chris, is, who works with you on lots of stuff, yeah. designed. It, that was a surreal thing for me to see when that came back yeah absolutely you know one of the things that uh, I'm very fortunate is that the, the, the network of people that I have in my circle yeah. that have different abilities you know when it comes to marketing uh, graphic design um, so I, I had this idea and I think I, I bounced it off you about this idea of kind of a set and, and you know being very electric playground ish and um, what he came back with was pretty freaking amazing. <laughs> it was rad, man, <laughs> super rad. And I, one of the behind the scenes stories here is that one of our first conversations is Brad had this tagline, uh, fuel for the mature gamer. Right, right. And I made him change it yeah. from mature <laughs> to savvy. And it, I, it never felt quite right, <laughs> yeah. you know, and, and I knew that and I thought, you know, with our personalities too, like, you know, we're only, I think you said it, you're only mature because we have to be. Yes. You know, we yeah. don't want to be, right? Totally. And, and, and the, the fuel for the savvy gamer, I think, uh, a little more uh, distinguished. It's, yeah, a little more distinguished, <laughs> and we're all savvy if we're having Absolutely. coffee and Absolutely. playing forever. I think, right? Yeah. And yeah. so the cool thing about your company, though, is that it's not you have a you have a, an actual location. Where is yeah. your Where is the location of Deadly Grounds? So our Deadly Grounds Cafe is just uh, about 40 minutes east of Toronto, a little okay. town called Curtis. So we do all of our packaging there for Deadly Grounds and Eat Bit Beans. Uh, we have a full cafe, a full uh, restaurant offering there. Uh, you know, we do a lot of crazy stuff there. All of our stuff is, of course, horror themed right now as yep. far as our drinks are concerned, our food, like a yep. Transylvania melt and things yep. like this. Awesome commercials, too. Yes, our commercials are pretty funny. <laughs> There's only one brew that gets my seal of approval. <laughs> uh, we're working on a really cool one for 8-Bit Beans as well, so uh, look forward to that. And you're expanding. And we're expanding. So the next thing that's happening for uh, Deadly Ground slash 8-Bit Beans is we're taking over a spot next to us, another unit, and that's going to be our 8-Bit Gaming Room, essentially. So we're going to have an arcade in there. We're going to have uh, board gaming um, areas for people to come and just hang out and play games and you know, play forever. And that's where I'm going to be coming to hang out next time I'm in Toronto for yeah. sure. Uh, but people can also pick up your coffee because you're shipping it into different coffee shops all across the yeah, country. All across, absolutely. just Canada for now? Right now, just Canada. Uh, we do have a partner in the States for Deadly Grounds, so he takes care of everything uh, kind of south of the border for Deadly. Cool. Uh, but 8 Bit Beans is available worldwide. You can get it wherever you are. Yep. Uh, we ship anywhere. Um, and cafe wise, yeah, we have about 100 stores across Canada that currently carry Deadly Grounds. Now we got to get those people carrying 8 Bit Beans too. Well, I got to tell you, Brad, it's been incredible getting to know you. This is the first time we're actually actually physically on location together like this, but it's so surreal to be the face of a coffee package that looks like an old Nintendo cartridge, which is the other cool thing. Yep. This is amazing. And of course, you can get it in the store, but also 8bitbeans.com. Absolutely. Awesome. Thanks, brother.